Hello, and welcome back to Everyday English. Welcome to the New York Times headlines. Learning English from newspapers can be a great way to improve your language skills. Let's look at a few headlines and break down their meanings. And a bunch of bloody Yanks came for English soccer. A bunch means a group. A bunch of people or things is a group of them. For example, we could say, he met a bunch of new friends today, or he met a group of new friends today. Bloody is a swear word mostly said by the British to express anger. Sometimes it means very. For example, bloody cold, bloody fool. Yanks. It is an informal noun shortened from Yankee. It means someone who lives or is from the US. The headline refers to wealthy US investors who are coming to England and starting to invest or buy English football teams. The headline was expressed angrily because the English fans are not happy with US investors coming to England, changing the stadium experience and rules that were made more than a hundred years. When prison and mental illness amount to a death sentence. Mental illness. A health problem related to the mind, emotions and thinking. For example, depression and anxiety disorders are a mental illness. Amount to. If something amounts to something else, it means they are added together. For example, we could say one amount to one equals two. Death sentence. A punishment of death given by a judge to someone who has been found guilty of a serious crime, such as murder. The headline refers to the African-American inmate, prisoner, named Marcus Johnson, who has a death sentence, and at the same time a mental disease shows a large failure of the US prison system to care for the mentally ill prisoners. TikTok tells advertisers, we are not backing down. Advertiser. A person who promotes products for people to buy. Back down. A phrasal verb to withdraw from an argument, or you could say give up. Punctuation is used in, we are not backing down to express the TikTok owner's anger. The headlines claim that TikTok's owners are forced to sell their platform, but they are refusing to do so. The former NFL player bought a pub in England, then his world implodes. Former, describe something that existed or happened in the past, but not anymore. NFL is an abbreviation for the National Football League. Commonly known as American football. Pub. The word pub is short for public house. Mainly a British and Irish word for a place where people go to drink alcohol and eat. His world. The term world here refers to his life or his situation. For example, we could say, she rocks my world, she makes me happy and fun. Implode, collapse or fail. The headlines article talked about how the NFL player's new pub business failed because of racism and discrimination he experienced due to his skin color. 